and he died at the piano just like that. And, uh, anyway, um, so, so anyway, so yes, so we thought uh, we did this blues album, and I've never done a, a blues album, but we've been doing a lot of concerts with Steve Miller, and uh, he, he, he's been I've known him since I was this big, and. Um, and uh, he's been a dear friend, and uh, so each night after we played our set, he would get me up to play some blues with him. And I got the, the bug that I, I'd never done uh, enough blues stuff, so on the bus home, sorry, on the uh, private plane home. <laughs> what do you mean? No, it was, it was, no, it was a bus. Uh, but it's okay. <laughs> And uh, on the way home, I just said, guys, we've got to go home and do a blues album. So we did. And we did enough for two albums. It's all covers. It's all old blues stuff. We did enough for two albums. And one is still in the can. And I just thought that sounded strange. <laughs> we've recorded one, and the other one's in the bathroom. So, so but anyway. Uh, and uh, so that, that'll come out one day, I, I hope. <laughs> and um, so we thought we'd, uh, the, the other person that, I'd like to pay tribute to Hoagie for writing this incredible song, but also uh, we, we favor the, the uh, version that was done by the person who I think does, has done the definitive version, Mr. Ray Charles.